Climate change is the crisis of our age and we will be judged by future generations on how we respond to it. The issues of climate is still not yet at number one goals. You are talking about reducing poverty and you don't focus on climate, then there's a problem. As I started my career in politics two years ago, I was given the opportunity by CPA to study parliamentary governance at McGill University, which I integrated into my established processes. This process I'm honored to share with you today. So as a select committee, we have an open inquiry on COP26 and Net Zero, uh, where we take evidence from stakeholders to try to fill in some of the gaps as we identify them and make recommendations to ministers about how they can improve their delivery plan. Uh, we've also decided to work across select committees in the House of Commons to set up a monthly Q&A on COP uh, for select committees, because whilst my committee has been leading the scrutiny, lots of other committees have their own interests in the context of COP and how that links to our domestic uh, delivery plan. The power of party, the power of whips, is less in upper chambers, which is why I think that upper chambers can be extremely helpful in this area. Trying to get a climate lens on every policy, every piece of legislation. What do you think would be a strategy to have parliamentary support of serious climate change ambitions when the democratic system is compromised, especially in developing countries? The strategy is, are we able to make this a core agenda of the developing countries, whether they're democratic or not? Yeah? to make it a serious agenda that in terms of their core priorities, you are talking about fighting poverty, you are talking about uh, universal health cover, you are talking about uh, industrialization, you are talking about housing, you are talking about some of all this. How can all this be linked with the issue of climate change? And beyond that, it gets to be de-escalated downwards. Let it not be at the national level. Any other strategy that we are talking about, if it is the national level, priorities keep changing things keep shifting, but if it is made to be understood at the very lowest levels, where the communities are and the communities get to own some of these things, in my view, uh, things are likely to change.